My name's Martin Tyler, his name is Alan Smith. We're together in the commentary gantry for you. With great anticipation, we're looking forward to the match coming up very shortly. It's Wren, and they take on Lille. Now, there's certainly a buzz in this stadium in the uh, minutes leading up to kickoff. I hope the match doesn't disappoint. I don't think it will. We've got a couple of attacking sides here. Goal kick here. Still heading for goal. Well, he did well to get to the ball first. That's the best I can say. Jose Font. Renato Sanchez. Now Rafinha. Another turnover in play here with that interception. Read the play well. Chance from the pass. Well, the keeper's got that. Well, they couldn't keep possession. They've given it away. That's a great interception. Remy, chance to go at the opposition with pace. Well, plenty of speed, but not much organisation. And the ball lost at a crucial time. Niang. Far post cross. Dealt with the danger. And Zonzi. The shot is blocked. It's a very good interception. This with a chance to go into the lead now. And now the goalkeeper can maybe think about starting an attack. Benjamin Burijo. Chance to cross it. Wriggle past one man. There's still danger here after this half clearance. And Zonzi. I think that's a decent save from the goalkeeper. Corner coming up. The fans saluting the effort their team's put in here and hoping they can make something of this set piece. Gives it away. This could be promising. Great ball. Got to be. Somehow he saved it. Corner played into the middle. Only partially away from danger. Trying to catch the other team out with a quick break here. Held off the defender with some good touches here. Well, here's an opportunity with the ball over the top. In with a chance. Uh, so don't know whether he recognised, Alan, that the goalkeeper was all over the place then when it came to him having his shot. Seemed to take his eye off the ball. Maybe he thought it was just a given he was going to put it in the back of the net. Probing with the pass. Now it's Remy. And he bangs it away. He might have put his teammate in here. Had to be very quick, the keeper there, to get the ball. Now he's lost the ball. Has to be! How did he reach that? Brilliant goalkeeping. And in it goes. Nico Gaita. Well, you look at those stats, I mean, the midfielders might say we're doing our job. We are creating the strikers with plenty of chances, but they're just not tucking them away. Haven't been anywhere near clinical enough. Surely! And there it is, the goal! It's a big moment in the match, Alan. A bad moment for this team because the title hopes might be slipping away. They're behind now. Yeah, well, it's all about character now and try and drag themselves back into this football match. Have they got it? So the first goal, it's 1-0. Going forward well. Nice piece of tackling here. And that's uh, strong defending. Intercepted well. 
almost lost his balance, but didn't. The referee has blown, and he's given the free kick. Well, that pass never looked like reaching its target, and they're away with the ball. Rafinha. Here it is now with Lille. On the attack here. Steven Unzonzi. Renato Sanchez. Nico Gaita. Oh, they thought they were in, but the flag has gone up. Steven Unzonzi. Good work, really, to read the intention of the pass. Good defending. Another turnover in play here with that interception. He's given it away. Nico Gaita. Renato Sanchez. Promising forward play from them again. Now, what is the referee going to do here? Clearly a booking, out comes the yellow card. Well, he reached straight for his pocket, he didn't really think about it, but I think that's the good call. Well, suddenly they could be on the counter-attack. That is a free kick. Steven Unzonzi. Rafinha. Proper defending there. That's a great interception. But well, the cross could come in here. Bounce back off the post. Well, sometimes you just have to clear it like that. Safety first. Oh, an important interception, that. Remy. Guided through. Now it's Remy. Surely the equaliser. That is a fantastic goal. With the chance to win the title, with a victory today, to get level, big psychological step up, one more step to make. Yeah. So much at stake, and uh, you've got to hand it to the goal scorer for the way he took that chance. Well, they've been knocking on the door for quite a few minutes leading up to that goal. I think they deserve it. It is uh, level. Both sides have scored here now. Well, the referee has blown for half-time at 1-1. And here we go, the referee's blown his whistle, and we're off for the second half. I think he saw the look from the other player and saw where the pass was going and read it. It's good attacking play, this, from them. Really in the clear now. A really incisive breakaway. Held his position, stayed onside, in at the keeper, but he's denied him. Oh, he's such a good keeper in these situations, you know. He's very cool, and he got his angles. Absolutely correct that. Here's Renato Sanchez. The referee's going to take action here. Well, decisive from the referee. No doubt in his mind that that was a yellow card. I don't know, you know, Martin, I, I know another referee might not book him for that offence. Andre. And that advantage has been applied to Lille here by a ref who really sees the opportunity for the French club. One or two players arriving in the middle. Reaching for it a little bit with the header, and that's the expected result. Back to the training ground, I think. 
Well, he's going to show the yellow card. That's good refereeing to go back to the original offence, having played the advantage. Yeah, you always felt that he would. It wasn't the best of challenges, that. Remy. And there's the interception. On the attack here. Gone on one possession back with that tackle. Read the play well to intercept. Remy. Renato Sanchez trying to thread a pass through but not successful. Really in the clear now, in on goal. Goalkeeper can only parry it out. That'll be a throw. Remy. It was an interesting pass, wasn't it? But it didn't get through. We've had an hour gone here, and still 30 minutes left. Bourdieu. Trying to get the ball in behind. Has to score! And there it is! Well, it was a gift. Strikers dream about moments like this. A tap-in. Yeah, it's not often that you do get what is literally an open goal, and he wasn't going to miss it. And we restart the game 2-1. He can go either side, he's gone inside this time. Floated in, back post. Renato Sanchez anticipated the direction of the pass and was able to intervene. Oh, he's through. Nicholas Gaitan. With good vision. This might be an opportunity to get level. Rebounds into play off the post. Coming into the penalty area now. The keeper stops it. There could be a follow-up now. He's got in the way. Cross has come to nothing. Here's Renato Sanchez, threads it through. Now it's Remy, bounce back off the post. And he's just cut it out in the nick of time, the crucial moment. Yeah, the hosts with less possession, that's interesting. Well, they do say possession is nine-tenths of the law, but uh, not the case here. They've used the ball when they've got it really well. They've been so clinical on the counter-attack more often than not. Now it's Remy. And the forward could be played in. It was a lovely pass. Surely the equaliser. Corner's taken. He should have made more of that. It's only a goal kick. Interception here. Just over a quarter of an hour left on my watch. Just read the intentions of the opposition there to make the interception. Going forward with real purpose now. It's a quick break. It's a goal! They would have come here, the supporters not contemplating defeat.
and uh, looking forward to celebration, but it's defeat they're going to have to deal with, it seems. Well, they've been excellent all year, Martin, but they just haven't reached those standards, anywhere near those standards so far. 3-1 the scoreline as we restart the game. He's made the interception. Going forward well. It'll be a corner. That old song you only sing when you're winning. Well, they're winning, but they do plenty of singing when they're not. Well, they're known for it, aren't they? And uh, it certainly helped the players out on the pitch there. It spurred them on to victory. Remy! Real finale set up now by getting the one goal back here. Now they'll go at it again. They want to get the ball from the restart as soon as possible and try and grab the equaliser. You have to feel it here in the ground because... There was such joy when that uh, two-goal lead was established very recently, and now they've had it halved. Yeah, and I think the next five or ten minutes, extremely important. They just need to put a lid on any further fight back. It's a terrific effort by the home side here. They've just kept their noses in front, and they're going to need all the support they can get for that to continue to the final whistle. Yeah, if they do end up winning this, they will have their fans to thank because they've been terrific out there today. Yeah. Off the keeper, back into play. Referee has blown and he's given the free kick. Certainly wanting to find a teammate, but he's just found an opponent. They need something from the realms of the Champions League final of 1999 of Manchester United's recovery then against Bayern. That's what they need, two late goals that would win them the prize. Yeah, they only come along once in a blue moon. I don't know whether we're at that point here. We've got two added minutes, that's been signalled now. now. You could see what he was trying to do, passed it into the net, but passed it off target, well off target. He's cut it out. And it's come to an end now as the referee blows the whistle for the last time.